how to delete cases in SPSS. If you're working with data in SPSS and need to remove some cases or observations, you're in the right place. Let's walk through the steps to help you manage your data effectively. First, understand that in SPSS, a case is essentially a row in your data view, representing a single observation or respondent. To delete a case, you need to be in the data view of the data editor. Start by navigating to the data view. Here, each row represents a case and each column represents a variable. To delete a specific case, place your cursor on the first column of the row you want to delete. Click on the number in that column to highlight the entire row. Once the row is highlighted, right-click on it and select Clear. This action will delete the entire row or case from your dataset. If you need to delete multiple cases, you can do this by selecting multiple rows. For example, if you want to delete several consecutive rows, click on the first row, hold down the control key, and then click on the other rows you want to delete. Right-click on any of the selected rows and choose Clear to delete them all. Another way to delete cases is by using filters. Suppose you want to delete all cases that meet a specific condition, like respondents who did not complete tertiary education. You can create a filter to select these cases and then delete them. To do this, go to the data view and create a new filter based on your criteria. For instance, if you have a variable indicating education level, you can filter out those who did not complete tertiary education. Once the filter is applied, Right-click on any row within the filtered data and select Clear to delete all the rows matching the filter. If you accidentally delete cases and want to restore them, SPSS allows you to do so. Go to the Data view, right-click on any row header, and select Revert Deleted Rows. Here, you can choose the rows you want to restore or tick the Check Uncheck All checkbox to restore all deleted rows. Click Revert to bring back the deleted cases. Remember, deleting cases permanently removes them from your dataset, so make sure you have a backup or are certain about the deletion before proceeding. By following these steps, you can efficiently manage your data in SPSS and ensure your dataset only includes the observations you need for your analysis.